Hey everybody, it's Minnie and I'm back with another video. So forgive me in advance, I'm not feeling so well today. I definitely caught a little bit of a cold. Um, I'm late uploading one video, but I'm filming this one so I could at least have two out this week because I like to put two videos out a week. Um, so normally tonight I would be going out, um, but I feel like shit. So I'm not going anywhere. Um, and before I get into this cool little video for you guys, which I hope you enjoy, I just want to show you guys, uh, I had some customers at work today and they gave me this Colombian coin and it has a little like tree frog on it or something. And I just think that it's so cute. I don't know how well you can see it, but apparently it's 500 pesos. I'm not sure how much that is. Um, I have gone to South America, but, um, they... I just I just used like American money and they took it so um whatever I just think this is so cool and I'm gonna keep it forever because I love tree frogs so yeah how awesome is that so today I want to show you guys how to make a DIY face scrub out of um all natural ingredients and um mostly it's stuff you can find in your kitchen and before I take you into the kitchen and um, film myself making this which is my first attempt at filming anything for YouTube outside of these four walls in this room so we'll see how it goes ladies and gents but um you know if you have sensitive skin if you have allergies yada 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 use common sense don't just go in the kitchen and start putting shit on your face if you don't know how your skin's gonna go react to it so I am sharing this with you, but please use common sense and caution when applying anything to your skin. Uh, I am not a doctor. Caution, caution, disclaimer, etc. Just use your head. Um, but yeah, so let me show you what's up and how I make my face scrub. Okay guys, so these are the ingredients you're going to need. Olive oil, or I guess you could use coconut oil, a lemon, honey, sugar, you can use any kind of sugar, and parsley. Oh my goodness, filming this is not easy, you guys. I cannot see what I'm doing. So you just want to mix that around until it's the right consistency. Not too oily and not too solid. So right now mine is obviously way too liquidy, so I'm just going to add some more sugar in there. So this is definitely more of the consistency that you want, more like a scrub. So I cut my lemon into some wedges so that it would be easier for me to squeeze into here. And I can already tell I'm going to make it too watery again, so I have plenty of room to add more sugar. And I'm going to keep mixing it up and see it's back to being too watery, just like I knew it would be. It smells really good though. Okay, so I'm back to having a good consistency and I'm just going to add parsley flakes. If I had regular fresh parsley, I would prefer to use that, but I don't. So here is the finished product and that is the consistency. And that's what it looks like. Oh my gosh, my hands just feel like so soft. Just, I accidentally got some of it on my hands and oh my God, you guys, oh, they feel so soft already. It's that olive oil, I'm telling you. So um, I didn't really give too much of an intro on this video. I just wanted to, to show you the uh, method of how I make this and now I will talk to you about it. So um, basically, uh, this is an amazing exfoliating scrub. Uh, it's also really hydrating and it will leave your skin so soft. Um, I did get this little jar at Sally Beauty Supply. What else is new, right? I'm always buying stuff from there. Uh, and it is an airtight seal. It has, like when you open this, it has a little plastic piece, um, so it makes an airtight seal. Because these are all natural ingredients, um, I, I really wouldn't, I think this would keep for about a week or two tops. Um, I just store it um, in the fridge. You can, you know, store it wherever you want, but um, things, the honey doesn't spoil or anything, but I, I wouldn't keep this longer than two weeks just no um so this stuff has great properties in it um the um olive oil is hydrating the sugar is exfoliating the lemon juice helps to tone and like 
lighten imperfections if you have like um color you know uh, problems or like sorry discoloration not color problems um it will help with that as well um as the parsley it's been known to help lighten up freckles and things like that so if you would just like to make a really good exfoliating scrub without the lightening properties just leave out the lemon juice and the parsley and use the honey olive oil and sugar and um then you don't have to worry about that so yeah, um, I just wanted to share that with you guys. It's a quick little DIY. It's the first one I ever did and I really hope you enjoy it. Um, I can't wait till I get a camera and I get a tripod. It'll be like so cool. I'll be able to film all kinds of new content, but I am trying with the equipment that I have. Even though I'm sick, I really wanted to put a video out for you guys. So um, I love you all. I hope you enjoyed this. Thank you for watching my video. Please feel free to please feel free to like, comment, or subscribe if you haven't already. Um, and yeah, thanks, and I will see you all next time. I love you so much. Bye!